as in one drawing in this lesson. You will work with Toon Boom Studio drawing tools to create frame by frame animation. There are two animation projects for this lesson Drawing Rough Drawing Final you'll use the Drawing Rough animation project to complete a walk cycle. You'll use the Onion Skin, Rotary Life Table, and the Toon Boom Studio Centerline Drawing Tools and Pressure Sensitive Brush Tool to draw the old man. To start the drawing lesson 1, download the Quick Start Tutorial files from the Toon Boom Animation website. You can click the Quick Start Tutorial link on the welcome screen to open the appropriate web page. 2. Open the Drawing Rough Animation Project in the Lesson 1 Drawing Folder. 3. Save the animation in a location of your choice using File Save As. Saving this animation project to a new location will ensure that you always have the original to return to and use should you want to. First step drawing the old man's head. In this step. You will draw the head of the old man using the ellipse tool. Because this drawing must fit with the other drawings in the element to create a complete cycle, you will use the onion skin to show previous and next drawings of an element as a reference while you draw. To draw the old man's head you must First in the exposure sheet window, click the first cell in the rough old man element and press the down arrow key on your keyboard. As you cycle through all of the drawings in the rough Oldman element, you'll notice that there is no drawing in the Ryu Oldman 2 cell. That's because you are going to draw it. 2. Click the drawing view window and set it up so that you have a clear view of the old man. To turn on and off the grid, press G, the default keyboard shortcut. To zoom in, press X, and to zoom out, press Z. To pan the drawing view window, press and hold spacebar and use the grabber tool to change the part of the window you are seeing. In the toolbar, click the onion skin button to turn on the onion skin feature. When the onion skin is active, the button looks like it is pressed in. Click the show previous button and select previous drawing and click the show next button and select next drawing. In the drawing view window, the previous and next drawings in the onion skin appear in a different color to distinguish them from the drawing you are working on. Select the ellipse tool from the drawing tools tool. Bar. If the properties window is not open, select a window properties. The properties window appears in the pen tab, type 20 for the maximum size value. When you draw with the centerline tools including the pencil, rectangle, ellipse, polyline and line tool Boom Studio uses the maximum size value for the width of the line. In the drawing view window, draw an ellipse roughly in the shape of the old man's head. Don't worry about the actual shape not being the same as the one in the animation. You will reshape it using the contour editor tool. Save your animation using the file Save command. Step 2 Reshaping the old man's head In this step, you will use the contour editor tool to move the points that make up the ellipse you drew in step 1 and reshape the old man's head. To reshape the old man's head from the drawing tools toolbar, select the contour editor. Click the ellipse you drew. You'll notice that a line appears down the center of the shape is center line and that there are points on this line. Use the contour editor to reshape the ellipse by moving the points and dragging the busy ear handles. To get the busy ear handles to appear, click a point on the center line. The final shape should be approximately the same shape as the old man's head shown in the previous drawing. 4. Save your work using the save command. In this step, you use the brush tool to draw the head and then the rest of the old man. Unlike the ellipse tool and other central line tools, rectangle, polyline, line and pencil, the brush tool creates variable width strokes that respond to the pressure you apply with a digital pen and graphic tablet. When you draw with the brush tool, Toon Boom Studio creates shapes that are formed by points that surround a zone, which is filled with color. We call the shapes created by the brush tool contour shapes. 
Drawing with the brush tool allows you to create distinctive lines that are more natural than the mechanical looking center line shapes. However, brush strokes require more memory to store because they use more points to create. If you are concerned about the file size of your animation, consider this carefully when choosing your drawing tools. To draw the old man with the brush tool, select the brush tool from the drawing tools tool. Bar. In the pen tab, type 5 for the minimum size value. When you draw with a graphic tablet and pen, Toon Boom Studio uses the minimum size and maximum size values to determine the width of the variable width line. In the drawing view window, use the brush tool to draw a circle approximately the same shape as the old man's ear is shown in the previous drawing in the onion skin. Using the contour editor tool, shift, click the old man's ear drawing and the old man's head. Notice the number of points in old man's ear drawn using the brush tool and the old man's head drawn using the ellipse tool. When you have finished comparing the drawings deselect them by clicking anywhere in the drawing view window. Using the contour editor tool and the curve handles reshape the old man's ear you drew so that it is approximately the same shape as the old man's ear shown in the previous drawing in the onion skin draw the rest for of the old man. The completed drawing must fit in the walk cycle so you must draw the old man's legs so that his left leg is goes down and his right leg is moving up. The rest of this video clip is a demonstration of how to draw the rest of the old man's body. If you have any additional questions, suggestions or requests my email address shows at the end of this tutorial. Thanks for watching.